A tipped over bus and scary moments in Hartsville. Tonight, a school bus driver counts his blessings after a routine rainy Monday takes a bumpy turn. It's just one of them things. I'm just lucky to be here myself, I guess. It started as a typical rainy morning for Don Robinson. Well, it's about six o'clock. I I knew it was raining, and I thought, well, I just wait till then, and I go out and crank my bus up. He was going through his morning checklist. And I was sitting there in my seat, and uh, the bus started rocking a little bit. When things got bumpy. It got re raining real hard, and it started rocking a little bit more. I turned my bus off. It was still running. I cut it off. The next thing I know, I, I thought I was looking, and, I, and the bus had done started I was looking at my barn instead of my house. It done turned on its side. And As the wind picked up, Don got another surprise when an RV landed on the overturned bus. It must have picked it up and put it up on top of it. I don't know what to say about that. It's just one of them things. Thankfully, he was not hurt, but he was stuck. I called a bus barn. And he thought I was joking. I said, no, I'm not joking. I'm still in the bus. Help came, and Don was eventually able to get out through the roof of the bus. So it was blown off. He helped me get out here. He pulled me out here. I'm all right. It, it just, it, like I said, it is what it is. I could have, it could have been a lot worse. Don's experience was just one of multiple reports of storm damage across the county Monday morning. Mostly trees down, roads blocked, fire lines down, uh, structural damage, mostly barns. There's his houses damaged. It's widespread all over the county pretty much. Sheriff Ray Russell expects some roads to be closed through Tuesday. Just be careful and clean up and, and uh, watch for power lines mainly. He's asking everyone not to drive around barricades and to turn around if a road is blocked. Just hang on for the ride. That's all you can do. As for Don Robinson, he's taking it all in stride. I've been in a wreck before, so I just thought, well, you know, it did one of them things. It could have been a lot worse. For sure. Thankfully, there are no reported injuries in Hartsville or any part of Trousdale County. The sheriff expects some roads to be closed through at least tomorrow.